Good morning students today we are going to do our second poem the kite this is the poem written by harry ben he is famous for writing kids poems in this poem the poet has drawn a beautiful picture of the flying kite through words we all love to see flying kites but never noticed how it flies here poet has beautifully described the movement of a kite and has compared it with the movement of a ship as the ship goes up and down on the crest of waves poet has also described that how the wind affects kite's movement let's read the poem how bright on the blue is a kite when it's new with a dive and a dip it snaps its tail now first look at the difficult words dive and a dip means to lower or drop suddenly snaps means cracking sound blue is the color and here it is used for the clear sky without clouds now the poet explains here a kite looks bright on a clear sky without clouds when it flies for the first time why first time it says is a kite when it's new new means it flies for the first time it moves with softness and force together at the same time to fly means sometimes it lowers and drops suddenly then again moves with a force it actually hurls because of which its tail create a cracking sound in the air now next stanza then soars like a ship with only a sail as over tides of wind it rides climbs to the crest of a gust and pulls then seems to rest as wind falls now the difficult words soar means to fly high climbs to go up sail is a cloth on a ship or boat which helps the boat to propel to move gust is a strong sudden wind tides rising and falling waves crest here is top top of anything like a mountain now here the poet explains that sometimes it flies it means kite kite flies high in the sky on the top with a sudden blow of strong winds in a wavy manner the way ship moves up and down on the crest of waves with a sail cloth but as soon as the wind slows down it seems as if it has stopped there to rest that means when wind blows strong the kite moves to the top but when the wind falls the kite comes to rest now when the string goes slack you wind it back and run until a new breeze blows and its wings fill and up it goes here slack means to lose and this is not wind this is wind wind is to roll roll back now here when the thread tied to the kite loosens the flyer runs and tries to roll the thread back he waits till a new breeze new air blows again and fills its wings with air again to help it to fly how bright on the blue is a kite when it's new but a regular thing you never will see when it flaps on a string in the top of a tree here regular means worn out torn now the poet explains here that a kite looks very bright and beautiful on a clear sky on a clear sky without clouds but when it gets struck on a top of a tree it gets torn and gives a poor worn out look which is not liked by anyone that means you never will see means that you don't want to see such a worn out kite so this was all about the poem 
now in the next class we'll do the exercise thank you